Did the rifle that G.I. Joe use fire bullets or lasers? Who has two thumbs and all the answers? This guy. Redcard will overthrow every government on the planet by controlling all forms of media and digital communication. We will do so by traveling back in time and adjusting history through retroactive continuity to make things work to our advantage. And we will do it with your help. Well, Hong Samo writes, G.I. Joe's rifles shot out laser beams, but also clearly spat out shell casings. Were they firing bullets or lasers? You think with all that shooting, they would eventually hit something. Devil... Smiley face, what are you, five? Let me point out that people were shot in G.I. Joe. Duke was shot in his shoulder in G.I. Joe the movie. And Bazooka was shot in the head when the Games Master had captured both G.I. Joe and Cobra members and placed them in a deadly funhouse. Bazooka was in a roller coaster talking to Alpine when he stuck his head up and got a cap to the dome. But what about the guns that G.I. Joe was using? The guns were definitely shooting out lasers, but what about the shell casings that Wellhung Samo referenced? Well, upon closer inspection, you'll see that they're not shell casings, but in fact, double A batteries. The batteries powered each shot that was fired, and spent battery cartridges would shoot out the side like shell casings. Seems very inefficient, doesn't it? But this was the 80s. We left the water running while we brushed our teeth and drank coffee out of styrofoam containers with sweet and low. Efficiency was not the word du jour. Thanks to Wellhung Samo, we have retconned G.I. Joe's rifles to not only work, but to also bring us one step closer to world domination. All hail Retcon! Wellhung Samo, I get it now. Very clever, very clever. <laughs> Dora, da 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 Dora, hey ya la Dora. <laughs>